My name is Jared Perkins, and my approach to answering the two questions on what I think the importance of small group ministry is through the gospel and why I want to be a life leader can be answered pretty quickly through parts of my testimony and just my experience here as a freshman at GCU through my life group and my experience in small groups. But to start, in my personal experience through my testimony and my maturing within Christ, I, it wouldn't have happened without a small group. In eighth grade, everything that I had planned for my life and everything that I wanted to do was completely shut down. And once I realized I had nowhere left to turn, I finally started to pay a little bit more attention in church. And I started to become more involved with my small group. I kind of started to ask more questions and dig deeper into my Bible. And my peers inspired me to go further and further. Until finally I realized how much of a fire that the Bible ignited in my heart and how much of an ambition and desire I had to want to learn more about the Word and to want to see all my friends thrive at church and have fun and want to come and be a part of this amazing kingdom. But it was through my small group and through the peers that I had around me that I realized the importance of community within a church and within learning about the Bible and learning about Jesus and learning about what he can do for your lives. It was when me and my friends were reading Ephesians 4 about maturity in Christ and how you had to grow together and be unified as the body of Christ that I finally realized and I started to recognize the importance that each and every single person made within just a simple small group even. And that each and every single person here was helping build each other up for an ultimate purpose. And it was so exciting to see. And I think that really ignited my ambition for being a small group leader as I got to be one. I got to lead uh, middle schoolers at junior high camp and just to be able to lead them and see that ambition in their eyes and to see the excitement that they had when it came to learning about Christ and learning about who he was. It was a feeling unlike any other where I got to lead people and I got to show people and be a support system exactly how the Bible teaches and to show them the word and to show them all that it offers. Plus, here at GCU, during my own being a part of a life group, I got to see that a life leader isn't just someone who does Bible studies and it teaches the word and it shows what the importance of having your Bible and knowing what it means and having that relationship with Christ is during your college years. But it also was a friend. It was a relationship. It was someone to just be there when you just wanted someone to talk to, when it was you just needed someone to talk to because it was a rough day or it's a freshman year, so it was a completely new experience. It was someone that was there and someone to talk. And just knowing that you can have someone there as a support system is such a vital part of the college experience, I think. So I think that really shows the importance in what I see in small group ministry and how it builds the kingdom of Christ and how it ultimately allows a community to be more involved when coming to learn more about Jesus and also how it strengthens the community here at GCU and allows for me or other people to be leaders within dorms, the community outside of campus and on campus. Thanks.